If you have a paid Prezi account, you have access to thousands of high-quality photographs to enhance your presentations. The Prezi image library pops up whenever you insert or replace an image. It also appears on the background and theme sidebar. With over 500,000 pictures to choose from, you're sure to find something you like. They're free to use, even commercially. They're made available under the Creative Commons copyright that lets you use or alter them without having to credit the artist. To use the image library, type a keyword in the search box and press Enter. Then scroll down to see the thousands of pictures matching your search. To place one in your Prezi, either double-click on the image or drag it into place. If you don't like the way it looks, right-click on it and select Replace Image. Use specific search terms to get a better selection to choose from. You can even filter your search by color. Different background images create a completely different look for your Prezi. Using the Prezi image library, you can easily compare a variety of different pictures to see how it affects your presentation. Be sure to choose a background that's wider than it is tall, or you'll get a background that looks funny. The Prezi background image sets the mood for your presentation. You don't want your background image to be too busy. It'll distract the viewer's attention. Try a search using abstract as your keyword. Texture is another good search word for a background. One of my favorites is bokeh. That's a term for a photograph taken with a special lens. Subtle bokeh images make a real good Prezi background. In addition to the photographs in the image library, you'll find clip art in the icons and symbols library. The icons are grouped into categories, so you can maintain a consistent style. You can search for icons using keywords. The icons are fully scalable, so you can zoom in as close as you want without it getting pixelated or fuzzy. There are more than 80 thousand graphics available in the icon library, in addition to the 500,000 pictures in the image library. Free subscribers? Well, you only have a few images and icons to choose from. I'd say that's a pretty good reason for upgrading to a paid Prezi account.